plays. We will look at another name wrestler here in uh, I just say competition. Sean Borme, he is in the green. Sean Bormet, pardon me, he uh, has 43 pins on the year, and he's been favored to win this thing, it seems, every year, and somehow falls short. Never made the finals. Well, he's here now against Jim Schakowsky of St. Lawrence. Bormet with an early takedown leads two to nothing top college prospect, no question about it. He's a two-time national junior freestyle place winner. He's finished third in the state tournament twice here. He's probably the best known and most accomplished non-champion the state has had. He wants to turn that around right now. He lets Joukowsky escape. It's two to one for met with the lead with a minute 20 left to go here in period one. This is the third time the two wrestlers have met this year. Bormet has a pin and a technical fall in their two previous meetings, so he has been dominating. And Tchaikovsky, a fine wrestler, only a sophomore. His best day is obviously ahead of him in this tournament. He won 33 matches, lost five, tied one. Bormet, as we mentioned, 47 and 0. There was a thought that he might pin his way through the tournament, but uh, while he's got a couple of pins, he has one decision by a 13-0 score, so so much for that idea. He does, however, have 43 pins. That's a single season state record. 45 seconds left in the first period. Bormet with a 4-1 to one lead now, and he is looking for the pin right here. Two points awarded, six to one. Bormet rides very high, and that's what you have to do to get back points. He just had the bar arm and the half Nelson in there on Jim Tchaikovsky and got two, a two-point near fall as they go off the mat. Mike Poles, the coach of Sean Bormet, coach of Providence New Lennox, Bob Trompetta. Vikings coach at St. Lawrence. Under 30 seconds to go here in the first period. This is the 145 pound double A final. Sean Gormet all over Jim Tchaikovsky. Gormet loves that, that sort of reverse chicken wing. Looks like he may. Betty yelling for Tchaikovsky to escape, get one, get one. Didn't quite get it, so at the end of one period, it's a six to one lead for Sean Bormet. That's probably a two point reversal against anybody except Sean Bormet. Great hit pressure. Just avoided the problem there. Well, Bormet went off the mat to get something out of his mouth the official's permission to do it. This is a wise move, otherwise it could cost you a point, as we learned last year. Bormet starting the second period on top. I think he wants to go for this pin and to kind of finish his individual high school career on top. Providence, of course, will be going in the uh, individual, in, in the team state uh, coming up. But uh, I think Providence Format would like to finish this season on a high. Let's it go. That's an escape, and now it's six to two. A minute twenty to go here in period number two. And Format getting a takedown, lightning quick. Let's it go again. So it'll be eight to three. Just a clinic being put on by Bormet here. Just superior strength, athletic ability, balance. Look how he's moving Tchaikovsky around. That's the thing when you face a great wrestler like this. It's, it's so difficult to get a good shot at it. Under a minute to go here in the second period. Bormet with the five-point lead, but has shown total dominance so far. Bormet, 43 pins in 47 matches this year. Wants to make it 44 for 48. Just superior hip pressure there to hip over Tchaikovsky for his fifth takedown of the match. 10-3. 30 seconds left, second period. Seconds left, and 
for Bet. Working Sikowski. The official at the top of your picture, Robert Jones from Decatur. Watch this. Now a near fall situation. Three seconds. And they break it. Potentially dangerous. 12 to 3 for Bourbet. Only three seconds left here in this period. What, what's the conference, you think? The officials are talking. Question probably whether it should be a two or a three point near fall. There was certainly five seconds worth of exposure. Just the question of when the uh, hold became potentially dangerous. Okay, talk more about what you mean by exposure because this is a key point that is often hard to describe. Well, when the uh, criteria for a near fall is met, which means that as a Bourmet gets a reversal, he now leads 14 to three and now lets him up. Uh, it means that the that uh, the shoulders, the plane of the shoulders, have crossed a 45 degree angle to the mat. Very close to a technical fall here, 16 to five. I guess Bourmet is trying to keep Tchaikovsky alive so he could pin him. Constantly getting the takedown and letting him go. A minute 30 to go. Seven takedowns so far for Bormet in the match, and the only points Tchaikovsky has scored are the five intentional escapes that Bormet has allowed, and now it's 18 to five. There we go, another one. A minute 15 left in this match. Now he's one point from a technical fall, leading by 14. This may be where he tries to get the pin. One minute to go. He's gonna go for the technical fall, one more takedown and it'll be all over. And Sean Bormat will have that state title he's always longed for. Does he have it? There it is. Sure he does. Technical fall, 22 to seven, a 15 point margin. And Sean Bormat, as you said, Rob, after a lot of years of disappointment, has certainly earned his state championship at 145. Sean Bourbet, congratulations, Sean, from Providence, New Lenox. I'll show you some of the action at the...